Um, Emma, congratulations. My goodness, another fantastic performance. And, you know, I'm wondering, I'm watching you in these films as you've been growing up, and I, for me, I would think when you get on the set, it must be just such a comfort zone because you're amongst friends. It really is. Um, you know, I've grown up with the cast and crew. You know, they've known me since I was this high, so it's, it's, it is. It feels like um, it's very it's just wonderful to work somewhere that's so kind of familiar and comforting, definitely. Yeah. And although you have been playing Hermione for almost 10 years now, um, it must be exciting, though, to kind of reinvent her with each film because as you get older, things change. Uh, yeah, I think uh, I really enjoy that aspect. And, I mean, particularly, I think, in this one, you see a very different side to Hermione. Um, so I really relished kind of doing something different with her and David and I were very aware that we were we were trying to to show audiences a different different side of her personality. Yeah, I wanted to ask you about that because oh poor Hermione, she's like her angst, like my heart was going out for her. I know, seriously, loads of angst, loads of heartbreak. Um, yeah, she really she really suffers in this one actually. Um, but you know, as an actress, that's a challenge and yeah, I, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, the scene with you and Daniel, like, you know, when you're sitting on the stairs together, was really heartbreaking. Oh, um, thank you. Tough, God, I'm so glad. tough to do that scene, I think? Yeah, it was really tough. You know, it's hard to make yourself break down and cry, and you can't really get away with, I don't know, acting it too much. It's, it's hard to get right, and, um, but, you know, uh, I think it turned out okay in the end, so I was happy with it. It, it was fantastic <laughs> to watch you. it. Um, you know, over the years, you've had such amazing opportunities to work with such fantastic veteran actors. And I know it's a hard question, but who really has kind of mentored you the most or who you've really enjoyed watching and learning from? Probably Helena Bonham Carter. Um, I think she's an amazing actress. I think she's great in this film, and she's going to be really great in the last one as well. Um, uh, I actually drink Polyjuice Potion and turn into her in the last film, so we've been working a lot together on, uh, you know, how she is going to come across as me in her body, if that makes sense. It's all very confusing. Um, but uh, she, I think she had a very similar experience to me as an actress when she was younger, and so she, she was really able to relate to my situation, and uh, she had a lot of great things to tell me, so I was for, I'm very lucky to yeah. have had the chance to, to spend time with her.